Brown girls are beautiful all day, every day. It's hashtag no days off. Greetings, everyone. Greetings. Welcome to another episode of Brown Girls Are Beautiful. I'm your melanated queen, okay? Lil Foxy, AKA Seven Wonder. Today, I wanna to talk about you setting the standards for your own life, not comparing yourself to other people, especially when people are showing you a facade of themselves on social media. And I think a lot of people get caught up in these antics. So I just wanna tell you, do not pace yourself based on someone else's standards, based on what someone else tells you should, you should be doing for your day and age, for your time, um, for whatever you have going on in life. You know why I say this is very important? Y'all, people get so caught up in the theatrics of nonsense. People are caught up in the minute details of nothing. People are caught up, you all, with the masquerade and the facades. There are people that you don't even know the life story behind why they are where they are today. There are people that are teenagers that have been basically paralyzed from the neck down. These are true stories. I've actually, I've, I was following this guy and I don't even know his Instagram handle anymore, but he became paralyzed. I think as a preteen, they said he wouldn't walk anymore. He walked. He basically went to physical therapy. Guess what? He got up out of that wheelchair and learned how to walk all over again. Not only did he learn how to walk, but he went to his prom. And guess when he, what he did when he went to his prom? He was walking. Not only did he walk when he went to his prom, but he had someone that he could accompany to his prom. So all of this nonsense that's going on, y'all, especially with the Kevin Samuels debacle needs to stop. People are out here acting as though they're a handicap because of certain scenarios in their lives and they are basically devaluing themselves based on the standards of something that doesn't exist, okay? Nobody sets the precedence for your life. Nobody sets the trajectory for your life but you and the universe and your divine creators, these ancestors, okay? And there are a lot of us that are under spiritual attack, okay? So when you factor in that math, Nobody can really tell you where you should be in your lifetime. And I just want to give a special shout out to all the melanated queens out here who are walking in your divinity. I want to give a definitely a special acknowledgement to the melanated kings and the melanated warriors out here, the true alpha males that defend our honor, that provide for us financially, mentally, emotionally, psychologically, spiritually, and that uh, will go to war and protect us physically, you all. Um, and I also want to let all the princesses out there understand that there is nobody that validates you but yourself, okay? So let's make that very clear, ladies and everyone out there. You validate yourself. What you do, okay, sets the um, altitude to how far you can go in life. And so basically what it is, is what do you want in life? Do you want to set a legacy? If you want to set a legacy, leave a legacy. If you want to write a book, write a book. If you want to shoot a movie, shoot a movie. If you want to do a video documentary about your life, do that, okay? Nobody walks in the same footsteps. And I don't care how similar your story seems to be or your path seems to be, no one person in this lifetime shares the same exact footsteps in this journey that we call life, you all. Okay, so that is the message that Brown Girls Are Beautiful wishes to introduce to you all. That is the message that I wish to convey today. Hoita East Donas Tag, you all. I was extremely tired. Um, I met some clients from out of town. Shouts out to them coming out from New York. And um, S is, well, I was going to say it is in German, but it's a little sunny. The sun, uh, the sun is not shining today. Let's just say that, okay? It's a little overcast, but it's still um, warm outside. So S East Varm, we'll just say that, you all. And uh, thank you so much for everybody who has been supporting the channel. Thank you for all the new subscribers. Thank you for all the likes and the shares. And um, I look forward to the trajectory of where Brown Girls Are Beautiful is going and how much we are growing, you all. Hashtag celebrate yourself. That is one of my mottos. 
um, because if you don't celebrate yourself then who else will and you can't celebrate yourself like anyone else and nobody else can tell your story and walk your journey the way you the way you do don't try to be like anybody else be like how someone else tells you should be you be like what is meant for you what's best for you that's what you do okay um, so don't worry about all these aesthetics all these non-sensory things that really mean nothing to us in life you all okay these physical objects that we see are just tools to get us to where we need to be even the way you dress the way you talk the way you walk the way you carry yourself your presentation is a marketing tool so always remember that when you're out in society because we are being judged okay if you are melanated it is extremely important to understand that um, communication and presentation is everything in this walk of life you all we are the ones that bear a heavy crown okay and what do they say about the one that holds the crown okay to he who holds the crown um, he wears a heavy crown he holds much responsibility all right so a lot of things that you see you don't really know what's going on behind the scenes just keep that in mind y'all all right hopefully you get the drift the gist of what I'm saying and you catch my drift you all excuse me um, but anyway I just want to say thank you all uh, blessings to you all continue like I said to walk in your divinity and until next time you all stay beautiful all right and I'll be talking to you later